Hey guys, how are you? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Dana. I have my daughter over there, Avery. Hi. She's earning those dollars. Mm -hmm. So, um, today in my video, I'm going to be doing a travel haul. Now, I am, I don't know if you're familiar with any of my videos, but I do everything on a low income. I am a low income budgeter, and I don't even know. <laughs> or yes we are actually going on a vacation soon it's not really a vacation it's a road trip slash move we're going from where we live now in Rhode Island back to our old um, state of Colorado and we are going to be picking up everything in our storage unit and then traveling back we will be hopefully if everything goes um, well we're gonna be sending spending a day in Denver a day in um, like at Rifle Falls, a day in Glenwood Springs, stuff like that, just so that way we can like kind of see our old, our old stomping ground because we do miss Colorado a lot. We want to move, but right now we are here <laughs> in the middle of a lease, so hopefully February. <laughs> but um, besides that, today I am going to be doing a travel haul. Now everything that I got is pretty much low income except for one thing, which I had to put on my credit card. Um, but everything else I paid cash for, I budgeted for, and this is actually going to be two videos. One of them is just going to be random, which is going to be like Goodwill, it's going to be Walmart, um, Amazon, Target, stuff like that. The other one is just going to be strictly Dollar Tree because I got so much stuff at the Dollar Tree that this would be like a four hour video if I didn't, or if I did combine them, if I didn't do them separate. So, the First thing I'm going to do is I should go ahead and like that video and subscribe. And uh, hi, welcome to the crazy family. <laughs> if you're new here, if not, thank you for coming back. Like, I really appreciate it. So, the first thing that I wanted to show you that I did get was I bought this huge, huge, huge bag. So, I thought it was super cute. So cute. This is what Christian would say. <laughs> I love those vines. So I got this one. You can't really see it. But it's so cute. This one right here is going to be from Walmart. It was $24.99. And this right here is basically going to be our suitcase. We are not taking that much stuff. I do have a couple um, carry-on bags already. One that we got from Disney World like, I don't even know, 10 years ago my daughter was four um another one that we got that fits underneath the spirit airlines hi kitty there's something like all of them sorry I, I have to take a break <laughs> oh what Just are you doing you'll see Thank more you photos can. of my big cat <laughs> isn't my kitty say hi you want to say hi <laughs> say hi <laughs> he said hi Actually, he was like, get off me. Put me down now. But, yeah. So, we got a couple of bags. But, I got this brand new one because I'm trying not to take suitcases. I'm just doing everything that fits in my car. And, we're taking a truck. No trunk. So, super cute. $24.97. So, the next thing mm -hmm. is, how cute is this? This was $5.99. And, I got it from Goodwill. Savers. Savers little Mickey Mag. So it's actually a cooler. I don't know if you can see inside. It doesn't need to be cleaned out. But it is a cooler. And we are bringing a cooler with us. But I thought this would be good to just put drinks. Extra drinks. So we thought we are going to be on the road for three days, guys. Three days. It's a lot. With two kids, it's a lot. So. This is what the inside looks like. I thought this was a really good deal. I got a, these are about five bucks. It is a 24 pocket over the door shoe organizer. And now when I moved here, I just took my car, anything that could fit in my car now. Because um, I like to organize the way that I am. I take um, those bungee wires. I don't really know what they're called. Um, they have like carabiners that you can hook to them as well. And I cut this in half. And then I put one on like the driver's seat, one on the passenger seat. And then I use the little, like the little pockets inside. So 
So you just take the little pockets and then you put your deodorant, your brush, um, sunscreen, because you're in a car, you definitely need sunscreen. I know it sounds weird, but I get sunburned all the time. Like, I know this is like acne, but this is actually part of my sunburn. <laughs> so, so my cheeks are red. But, look at that. So I'm going to be taking these, separating them, and just sticking them in the back of the, the car to organize some stuff. I swear by these, even though right now I'm making a huge mess. But those are amazing, and you can stick anything in them. Another thing I got, that one was from Walmart. This one right here is actually from Amazon. So these right here are packing cubes now. When we moved here, I know I had packing cubes. I just don't know what happened to them. So this is a set of seven. Them up. Now I love packing cubes and dropping stuff. <laughs> I love dropping stuff. It's my it's my favorite. <laughs> but no, this one right here came with uh, like a little clear bag. So I'm gonna put toiletries in there. This one is a garment bag. It's pretty small, but I'm just gonna put like extra stuff in there. Um, it came with this one. It's like a small size. This one is a medium size. This one is the. Oops, sorry, there's one more in here. And this one's a pretty big size. Look how big that one is. It's gonna fit a lot. And then this is the one that they all came in. That one's pretty big as well. And then my awesome daughter got it off the floor. But Yay. this one right here says it's carry on approved. It's a one quart size bag. But look at that one. That one's cute too. So these are definitely going to help us. There's three of us going. I also got some movies. They're probably going to be split up because I don't know what all of them are. Ooh, I know what one of them is. But I got this one right here, which my kids already watched. Um, but it is Sonic for the road trip movies. Okay, so another thing that I got from Amazon, I actually just took it out the bag. <laughs> but um, I got one of these. Now, this is like a fanny pack that goes underneath your clothes so that way... And even it's super soft, but it goes under your clothes so that way people don't really know that you're wearing something like this. Now, I am going to be having not really a lot of cash on me, but I will be having some cash on me because that's just basically how I budgeted for this trip um, with my cash envelope savings. So, I thought, so I went ahead and you know, compartments. Um, I got one of these just so I could feel safer when I'm running into. Like areas that I just don't know and I'm going to have to go get gas and right now things are crazy. So um, just to keep my money and feel a little bit safer, I have this one right here. So I'm going to be using that. And then we got it open, guys. Yeah. Now you guys are probably going to be like, you are the biggest geek ever in the world, which, yes, <laughs> you are correct. Um, Batman, Lord of the Rings, Doctor Who, Supernatural. Oh. Jack Black. <laughs> so, um, I love this movie and I was able to actually find this on Amazon <laughs> and I was like, I don't know, I just love, like the tribute is it's my song. I'm, I'm very weird. <laughs> but, um, I absolutely love Tenacious D. I love Jack Black. He's hilarious. So, I went ahead and I got this. My kids have never actually seen this. I'm not really sure it's appropriate for my kids to see it, but they are teenagers and they're probably gonna see it anyway <laughs> so i went ahead and i got that another thing that i got which i am excited about was something i was saving for so this one right here is going to be from amazon and this is the coolest thing ever so this my fringe is a outlet so i've been watching a lot of like truckers travel and stuff like that um when i moved out here we have gotten into our car and we just drove and i spent a lot of money on food even though we had coolers and stuff like that um a lot of our stuff got wet and so um i'm trying to think of ways to be smarter about it this time so i ended up 
deciding that I'm gonna cook a whole bunch of stuff and like crock pot stuff put them in bags freeze them and then when we're driving I'm actually going to be using either the instapot that I have or my crock pot so this right here it plugs into the cigarette lighter and this is gonna be like a really big douchey thing to say but it's not my truck <laughs> so I don't care if I burn out an outlet like they're gonna charge me for it yeah but um that's a very douchey thing to say I shouldn't say that but Hopefully it doesn't happen, okay? I've seen a lot of people use these and they've been doing good. It had some burns on their outlet. But um, this goes into your cigarette lighter or your, I don't even know what it's called anymore. Cigarette lighter. Um, hole. Your hole. <laughs> so, and then you just turn it on here and then you can plug any appliance. I've seen them where they actually, some guy was sitting in his car and he plugged on a TV and then he hooked his PlayStation up to it and he was playing his playstation in the car and this right here has enough juice to do that i'm not doing that i'm just going to be like pretty much reheating food on a very low setting um for like maybe an hour hour and a half if i cannot find a um a convenience store like a lot of convenience stores have microwaves that you can use if i can't find that for some reason i'm definitely going to be using these now this was only about 25 I think it was like 24 and change and like I said you just plug it into here right here you can like charge your phones stuff like that I am excited that I got this if it makes me a bad person I understand <laughs> but I'm trying to save some money so for the price of this you know it's like one meal at McDonald's for me and my kids so that was good I also got I got glasses guys so I wear glasses and I am pretty blind and so I have to literally have glasses that are big enough to fit over my regular glasses. It looks completely ridiculous <laughs> and it looks really stupid but this is the only way because I don't have those fancy tilted like or tinted glasses like my son has <laughs> because it's for like $200 extra and I do for my kids but not for myself. So. I got me glasses that fit over this glasses so I don't drive into, I don't even know, a corn maze <laughs> because I'm going to be driving in Nebraska for seven hours so yeah. So another thing that I got was a brush. So my brushes always disappear and so I was like I'm just going to take one of these. I know because you steal my brushes all the time. She's pointing to herself like I don't know. There's only two people in this house that brush their hair. <laughs> and if I'm not losing it, <laughs> I'm not pretty committed. Yes, it's me. And then I put it somewhere and forget about it. Mm -hmm. Sorry. Brush. Brand new brush. If I lose it, I lose it. I don't care. This was actually on sale for about four bucks at Kohl's. So, I got this one. And it looks like a roadmap. That's me anyway, doesn't it? Like the grids of a city, a flash drive. It looks like Batman. Do I need this? No. Was it 588 at Walmart? Yeah. <laughs> so, flash drive. I'm gonna take that. Since I'm taking you guys with me, if you like it or not. Well, I hope you like it. I mean, don't dislike my video, but <laughs> I'm gonna take you guys with me. So I need a flash drive to keep all my my crap. My uh, things that I can't keep on my memory cards. Got some razors, which are extremely important. Definitely need razors. I got another movie. A sea creeping outfit. <laughs> it's the birds. Classic. Very, very classic. I don't know why we chose these random mix of like movies, but uh, me and my kids, we were like, oh, let's get this one. It's a classic. Do you have any regrets? That probably says a lot about my family. I understand <laughs> my choice of movies, but. It's classic. So, an extra charger. This one right here is from Five Below. And I don't remember how much. Oh, I do. It was $4.99. I got that one. And then I got some of these. This one right here is from Walmart. Um, just in case every does everything doesn't fit into the other one. I went ahead and I got this. So, this one is only a set of three. They were about $9.99. Which was a little bit half of what I paid for that one, but look at that. packing cubes. 
from Walmart. This right here is in the travel section. Like, a lot of the Walmarts that I went to didn't even have these, but I was finally able to find them. So they do come in a set of three. But I really love packing things. When my kids were little, I would put everything in, like, um gallon bags like whenever we would go anywhere but now that they're bigger and their clothes can't really fit in that um packing cubes are pretty awesome okay from this one right here is from burlington and it is just a visor for the car it gets extremely hot in the summertime so i just figured if i lose this i lose it it was only 6.99 from burlington and um yeah, we're going to take this with us in the truck. Put that over there. Alright, I got this cute little bag. Look at this. Ooh, ooh, it's so pretty. It's a little rainbow. So I got this right here. This was actually five bucks. Yes, five dollars. That five below. And I figured that because we are going to try to go to, um... What is it called the hot springs we're gonna try to go to the hot springs so i just figured that just bring something with us like this we might go out to um like i said to rifle falls it all depends on our timing and how fast we can get through the storage unit and sell everything um but i just thought that this was going to be a really good investment plus i mean it's summer and i live in rhode island and there's beaches everywhere <laughs> so if i don't use it on the trip then i'll definitely use it like in the future look at this from walmart some little socks i got these specific especially because they are up look at there's carl carl's in there russell oh, let's see oh kevin kevin's in there and the hop for the house <laughs> and there is Jack. Look at Jack. He's such a good boy. Alright, I totally got these. Now, I'm not sure if I'm going to take them with me because I'm weird. Okay, so I have a full wardrobe that is just dedicated to Disney. I go to Disney. It used to be, I go to Disney at least. It was every year. Now they kind of price me out a little bit. So, um, we go like every two years. The last time we went though was long time ago we were supposed to go on the cruise in 2019 which would have made it our two year then that got canceled and then 2020 happened so we don't even think about that year so we have a disney cruise and it's supposed to be in october we don't know if it's gonna happen or not most likely it's gonna be switched to something else so i might i might save these for that um if you guys come back and you see my storage video you're gonna see that i have a ton i have a whole wardrobe of disney so that might be in there <laughs> um but i might take them because i freaking love up it's like one of my favorite movies and then and then i got villain socks because i am a villain i grew up and i realized that i was yzma and i'm kind of mad about it kind of like okay kind of Still trying to kill llamas, you know, all that, all that great stuff. Cusco, gotta go. What the hell? God damn it. But anyway, that's <laughs> beside the point. <laughs> Alicia played by Eartha Kitt. Right, Eartha Kitt's amazing. <laughs> and Catwoman, Batman, 60s. Yeah. 1960s. So, <laughs> anyway. Um, yeah, so I got these cute little socks. This one has Maleficent, who actually is my favorite villain. And then Dr. Facilier is my second. But I got this one right here. I don't know if you can see it. I don't think you can. But it's Scar. Freaking love Scar. And then Ursula is on there. And Hades. Ooh, you never really see Hades. And then Cruella is in there. And then the Evil Queen. So, again, I might save these, but at the same time, I need socks, so I should just wear them. To be determined. Alright, another thing, garbage bag. So, when you are traveling, please, I don't even care if you're like, I'm only going two hours away, or I'm only going to work. 
my car gets so dirty it's ridiculous every single day that i pick up my son like he will go to the back of the car get a bottle of water drink it and throw it in the back seat like for real like for real and he's 17 like for real so garbage bags because i'm not living in filth <laughs> in my car you know so gotta take these with me deodorant if you don't have deodorant you're not going you're gonna walk your ass there because you're not getting in my car without deodorant on okay some headphones this is from target some old navy flip-flops because if they're three dollars old navy makes the best flip-flops and if something happens to them they were three dollars like for real but old navy flip-flops you definitely need those for a road trip <laughs> allergy relief yes i have two kids with allergies yes that one right there was from target okay let's see what whole bunch of crap i'm telling you this video is gonna be long so go ahead and subscribe if you haven't subscribed and you're still here watching this nonsense okay so this one right here is motion sickness this one is a walmart brand i believe this was like two bucks like 288 at the most um it only has eight tablets in it so it was probably less than that but i have a kid that always gets sick it throws up in my car yes i need those yeah. oh i did not buy this for the trip but it just happened to be in there and it's my favorite ever the winter candy apple from bath and body works um this is like this is my life this is what i smell like every day if you're ever like what does she smell like she looks like she owns a ton of cats well i'm covered in cat fur but i smell like winter candy apple so why would they be why do I, like? I don't know <laughs> no idea. But well, you're welcome. Guy <laughs> that one guy with like a smell fetish. <laughs> I know there's someone smelling the screen right now, just like. <sighs> <laughs> what does she smell like? I smell like a hot mess. I'm sorry. <laughs> so. <laughs> Alright. So I ended up taking them out already, but I got some more flash drives because I anticipate filming a lot, especially since I'm gonna be with my best friend and I haven't seen her in like years, so. Yes, flash drives. And they were brand new. They were at Walmart, I think they were, oh my God, how much were they? Like $10 for two, something like that. I also, <laughs> which I don't know if you care about this, but I got a pair of Vans. Now, slip on shoes, like, I definitely need these um, when I was driving last time my legs actually swelled I'm still looking into trying to get Ted hose and I keep forgetting <laughs> but my legs had swollen because I was actually in the car for three days like I even slept in my car because I didn't care and I was being cheap so um, I needed a pair of shoes but I wear these to work and I wear them everywhere but I did just buy these like not too long ago another thing that you definitely need to take with you is some pain relievers so I got ibuprofen which actually is one of the best um, if you have like cramps periods stuff like that and it helps with like like bloating not really with bloating I don't, I don't know how to say it inflammation that's it it helps with inflammation there's someone honking outside on my street and they're not stopping so i'm just gonna keep going <laughs> so ibuprofen helps with inflammation that i learned not from my pharmacy class but from my pharmacist <laughs> Um, this one right here is actually just regular pain reliever and Tylenol. Definitely always bring this with you. I've actually gotten into this because I get migraines and sometimes I use this, sometimes I use the other one. But I went ahead and I got those. Yes. I went ahead and I got these. Like, sometimes these are hard to come by, but I plan on packing like one box with me it comes with eight one i'm gonna definitely go ahead and make meals ahead of time in the crock pot freeze them in this bag once i get it in my car just gonna stick it in there call it a day so crock pot lighter and clorox clorox disinfecting wipes now staying in a hotel staying like 
anywhere being in a car it is 2021 guys and i don't trust all these people walking around without masks talking about i've already been vaccinated no you haven't <laughs> not all of them have um so i want to just make sure that my kids are safe i do have a child who has um a very weakened immune system so unfortunately i'm like terrified terrified that she will get sick so got some of these i also got some of these now these right here are just medical grade masks that i stole from my job but you can buy them at walgreens <laughs> um i have to wear these anyway every single day we're not allowed to wear regular masks so i just asked politely and was going to take them if they said no but no i'm just kidding i'm just kidding don't fire me um but i went ahead and just got a whole bunch of masks so that we could be protected on the journey if they get ruined if we need new ones whatever um but just being sure that we always have masks especially in the car um getting out to go in to get gas or to the bathroom or something like that another thing that i actually always keep in my car um so i'm not going to take that bottle with me i just got a brand new one but i have germax now um there's only certain ones that i will actually use like i won't use any of the knockoff brand um but i definitely like this one just going to keep this into the car or in the car and um yeah always sanitize my hands let's see I got this one because I thought it was pretty. Look at this, guys. There's words on it. But it's just a soap holder. But it looks like a little diamond. Like a gem. And we got showering. Some shave gel. Walmart. Lint roller. This thing was expensive. It was like nine bucks. But, yeah. I want to look nice. No. I don't want to always look like I have like cats surrounding me. They don't know I have cats. Well, everybody knows I have cats, but I'm gonna see people for the first time in like a long time, so I want to look nice, <laughs> right? Um, I did pick up some of these just in case, but I'm gonna probably be using these for receipts. So I have this one right here, and I have this one. They were at Staples, and they were dollar each, I want to say, but I just thought that they were really nice. So I'm gonna bring those with me. I actually don't know where I got this from. I might have got them from the Dollar Tree, but I love these things. I love them. So, I'm going to clean out your teeth between meals. I'm not always going to be able to pull over and brush my teeth after every meal, so. Let's see. Glade, because boys stink. And I'm traveling with a boy. So, it smells good. But I thought it would be good for the car. It would be good for the whole house. All that great stuff. Got some baby powder. Woohoo. That's my sweaty ass. <laughs> um, some Nair. Because, in case, I don't know. Let's see. What else did I get? Oh, so I got these things. I they were pretty cute. These came from Walmart. They're a little suave. This one right here is the conditioner, so this one must be the shampoo. Um, it is almond and shea butter. Oh, these are actually really nice. Sunscreen. Yes, sunscreen. So I got this one. It's the Sport One 50 Plus. Mm, banana Boat. I actually really like Banana Boat. I got that one. I got this. Walmart. It's a little light. Woohoo! Oh my god, yeah. Got this right here. This is a volume and fullness dry shampoo. And I think the last thing that I'm going to show you is just going to be a simple bar of soap. Now, I bought this in a bigger pack. Some for my house, some for here. Do not waste money buying a single bar of soap. Like, that makes no sense. Like, you're going to use more soap <laughs> like keep it at home give it to a friend put it in a stocking stuffer like a stocking stuffer gift or a gift basket go ahead who knows but you're always going to use soap so at least buy like a three pack because it will save you money so here's my soap and 
I think that is it. Now this video has gone on for so long and I do apologize. It was a hot mess just like me. So if you're still here, go ahead and subscribe to my channel because I need some subscribers. <laughs> but no, um, I hope that this just kind of gives you a, a look into what, no, I don't want to say normal people, but the average person uses on road trips because I've seen some people and they're like look at me I'm taking my brand new $2,000 phone with me and I get a brand new phone case I'm just like I got some deodorant <laughs> you know um that's what I need for my road trip is deodorant and toothpaste and toothbrush so um I hope that this does help you and if not, there are so many other tutorials you do not have to watch this one. Um, so many hauls, you didn't have to watch this one. I don't really know why I said tutorials, because I'm not showing you how to do anything. <laughs> if you really want to know how to put deodorant on, though. I got you. I got you. Let's see. I got some somewhere. All right, guys, I will see you later. Have a good day. Bye. <laughs> and the last thing that I'm going to show you is just some um, ibuprofen. This one right here is from Walgreens. And then this one actually is pain reliever from Walgreens as well. So I feel like you always need medication. It's like for real? Are you done? They're just honking like crazy. They're like, hurry up with the video. I'm trying. If you're waiting for somebody, they clearly don't want to talk to you. You should just leave. Okay. 